come on in. Today, I'm doing a room tour. I'm super excited. I moved into this place a few months ago. I'm living with Drew, Claudia, and originally Lexi, but then Lexi moved to New York. And now Olivia lives with us, which is exciting, but I live downstairs on the bottom floor. I have this amazing space, so I have like a nice living slash work area, and then through there is my bedroom, but we'll get to that later on. Um, when you first walk in my door, which is what you just did, this way you have a little like purse rack where I keep my purse, and I have a couple other bags there too, and then this random art print. No clue. I don't know where a lot of things are. I'm gonna leave a link to my interior designer's blog, and I'm gonna leave a lot of links to like stuff in my room down below, so check the description box for lots of info. This is my workspace. Have a nice like gallery wall, I guess, with a lot of random art prints, and then I have some photos from like my trips and some photos of me and friends, which is nice. And then I have this little rolly cart next to my desk. It has a bunch of random stuff to be honest, like planners and journals, and then like camera stuff, and then random stuff. I have this, which just also holds random things, but it like looks okay. Scissors. And then this is my desk. I'm not sure where it's from. I think it's from like Mod Shop or something like that. I'll leave a link down below, but it has this cool wood detail. And then I have like a ghost chair from Ikea with this little fluffy thing over it. I have my desktop. Go buy Drew's new Go single. buy my new song. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have dead flowers because I'm honestly too lazy to change them and they look kind of good. So yeah, I have this, which also it just is Honestly, just a place for me to like keep random stuff, but it still looks organized. Um, so yeah, I have my desktop. I have this little thing that says my at name, which is really cute. Got a glass of water. Gotta stay hydrated. Um, I have a lamp. I have a photo of my dad. Tape and some pens and highlighters. Also, I'm kind of sick, so you can probably hear it in my voice. I sound kind of gross, but whatever. These are packages for a video that I'm doing, so don't mind that. Over here I have my makeup organizer. This is the Alex 9 drawer from Ikea. Everybody has it. It's literally filled with makeup. The first few drawers are like pretty organized but um, as it gets to the bottom it becomes kind of messy because I... Example. <laughs> I get a lot of packages. On top I have a Skull Piggy Bank. I think this is from Urban Outfitters. A candle, I have a shocker candle, and then I have this fun um, art that my friend drew. It's me, and I'm bald, which I love. Over here, I have a mirror. I actually just put this here yesterday because Drew told me to. It looks really good, guys. This video. Um, it's from West Elm. It wasn't mine. I think it was Lexi's, and she left it here, and I just stole it. So yeah, I like it. You know, check myself out before I leave the house. Um, I have this basket which just has like board games and a blanket and like just random stuff to be honest that I just kind of put over there. This is like the main part of my room or this room which is my shoe wall. I knew moving into here that I was going to put all of my shoes on this wall. I'm a shoe addict. I love shoes more than anything so I love that I can display them here. I have kind of a system. These are like random shoes. These are my, my hype shoes, as I call them, like all of my more expensive shoes. These are all of my black boots. Then I have all of my, like my heeled sandal type things. And then I have two rows of sneakers, street sneakers, and then like workout sneakers because love sneakers. Also love black boots, clearly. And then this is my couch. Again, not sure where it's from. I'll try and leave a link down below. I just have, you know, some fluffy pillows. I'm sure this is from Ikea. This is from Ikea. This pillow, I believe, is from Target. Last year, I bought it, and I just put it on my couch. It's a little bit early, but I don't care. Um, over here, I have a ladder <laughs> so that I can, I mean, I can reach the shoes realistically, but I don't know. I just have it, whatever. On the side over here, I have, you know, some coloring books and coloring pencils for, you know, anybody that wants to color when they come over. Over here, I have some shelves. These, again, no clue where they're from, but I have a pair of my newest shoes. These are from Balenciaga. They don't fit on my shelf, so I was like, I'm just going to display them here as art 
and obviously I'm going to also wear them, but they're incredible. And then I have some vinyls, and my record player is like right here on the floor because I don't really have any other place for it. This is a fake plant because I kill all of my plants. Like literally, the only live plants I have, dead. <laughs> so I have a fake plant, I have this little thing which literally has nothing in it, some crystals, some books, and a uh, Polaroid camera. And then this wall and that wall have brick wallpaper, so it's obviously not real brick, it's just wallpaper, which is really cool, and that's like my favorite thing that um, Carrie did for me. And then here I have my 1 million subscriber plaque, and I'm so happy that I was able to like mount it on the wall, and I love looking at it. It's, oh, I love it. On this wall I have my TV, I have a Samsung, it's a smart TV because I don't watch live TV at all. I, I, like, I don't have cable or anything, so I just watch Netflix and Hulu and YouTube on my TV. This here is my table. Not sure where it's from. Again, I just have a candle, some glasses. I have Vogue and some books. My passport is just sitting on my table, which is, I don't know if that's dangerous, but <laughs> whatever. And then, Remotes. I have two rugs. I know this one is from Ikea. No, it's from TJ Maxx actually oh. But I think they sell like the same one at Ikea and then I don't know where this huge rug is I have the same one in my bedroom, which if you follow me this way through my hallway I will show you that I have this like fake uh, Head thing from the Melrose Trading Post. It's not real guys, and then it just has like this piece of fabric draped over it because why not and then this circle mirror I want to say it's from Urban Outfitters but I really have no clue um on the right side here is my bathroom I have this lovely floral wallpaper um yeah you know just like a normal bathroom I have some shelving over here with perfume and makeup brushes and more fake plants then these things which hold like makeup wipes and air freshener. Those are from Ikea. Um, you know, just classic bathroom stuff. Toilet, shower. I have this little furry stool and some extra like towels and such. On the back of the door, I have like, this isn't my everyday makeup, but this is like frequently used makeup that I keep here because I get ready in the bathroom. I have a robe. This hanging thing is from Ikea as well. I have this little like knitted thing, not sure where that's from. And moving into here is my bedroom. I have a clear door. This is my room when you first walk in. I love it so much. I'll start over here. Um, I have a candle on top of my dresser, which is from HD Buttercup. It matches my bed. I absolutely love it. It's, a, it's a reclaimed wood and white. It's so cute, except for it's like not big enough. It's literally packed full, like I can't even open the drawer because it's so full. Um, I have these shelves which are from the Mellor's Trading Post as well. This is supposed to have a plant in it, but it doesn't. That's from Ikea, and then I just have a bunch of like random stuff on those. And then I have this bowl where I keep all of my chokers and random jewelry. Not organized at all, but like it works. <laughs> I have this which my uncle got me for my birthday, it's like a little like jewelry thing and it says happy 18th birthday which is cute and then this is a photo of me and Rebecca in this fun frame and over here is my closet which is honestly really small but I make it work in here um, it's like pretty organized I mainly have it like color coded and then this is like it looks unorganized but it's just a bunch of like hoodies and then here I keep bras and then socks bathing suits and underwear down there and then up there is just like random stuff that I want to hide away and then in here I keep my suitcase and then this used to be a bunch of my jackets but then I just started putting random clothes and then like my most worn jackets because I started running out of room in here and so I moved my coats to like a coat closet under the stairs outside of my room which is good because honestly it doesn't even get that cold here um if you want to turn around I have a full length mirror, that is from Ikea as well. This print, I feel like this is from Society6, 
Yeah. I, I'm not sure. It's cool though. She has like fish in her hair. <laughs> I don't know. I like it. And then I have these fun like hooks on the wall where I keep a couple statement coats. This one is from Brandy Melville. This one is from Nasty Gal. And then I have a backpack and a belt. And then here I just have a small table. I'm not sure where the table itself is from, but I have some more fake plants. This for a seti candle that I got for my birthday. And then Alexa Chung It. This is my first bedside table. Not sure where that's from. And then she stuck these little stickers on it, which I think is really cool. I have a bunch of books. I have another fake plant. I have a dream catcher right there. I have these drapes, which came with my room, and then she added these ones just for like texture and stuff, which I really like. This is my bed. Um, like I said, it's from HD Buttercup. I absolutely love the wood. I think it's so cute. And then I think my bedding is from CB2. I'm not sure. Um, same with the pillows. No clue where they're from. But I'll try and find out and leave a link down below. I have silk sheets that I just recently got. And I'm obsessed with them. You can see I have like two silk pillows right here. Oh. Wow. My God. Wow. This blanket I know for sure is from CB2. Then I have my laptop here. And then if you swing around here, I have this little like thing. Not sure. I just like sometimes I sit on it. Sometimes I put stuff on it. I have another one of these like interesting shaped um, shelves, but in black this time. This is a photo of me and my sister when we were really little. So cute. And then she put some of my bathroom wallpaper in the back of this, which I think is so cute. Fake plant and then some little, like, things. Um, another art print probably from Society6. I have a chair here. Not sure where that's from with a little, like, fluffy thing. And then a St. Laurent shoebox just because why not. I have this cool ladder thing. Once again... Don't know where it's from. <laughs> I'll try and find out and leave info down below, like I said, with everything. I have a bag here and then a beret. Um, this cool hanging light, I think, is from Ikea. And then she just, like, mounted it to the wall. Really cool. I honestly never turned it on, and I only turned it on for this video, but... It looks good. It's so cute. Then this little side table. I have a candle. I have a book, a magazine, and then this is my essential oil diffuser. And then I have some essential oils back there. Um, this thing says I had too much to dream last night. This is wallpaper that she then hand painted. It's so dope. So I think it started out as like white wallpaper and then she like used a sponge to like sponge this like gray texture onto the wall, which I absolutely love because since we're renting the place, we can't really paint the walls. I mean, maybe we could, but I don't honestly want to have the hassle of having to paint them back. So, wallpaper. Yeah. It's a good life hack. I forgot to mention my rugs. This is the same rug that I have out in my living room. And then this, um, like, cowhide rug. I don't think it's real. It's from CB2, maybe. Well, um, you know, that's my room. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for, you know, touring my space. This is where I live and work and hang out and... I love it. I'm so happy with how the whole design turned out. It feels very like homey, which my last place didn't. My last place was like all Ikea and it just felt very like, I don't know how to explain it, but like this feels like a home, which is really, really nice. So yeah, like I said, lots of info in the down bar, lots of links. Thank you for watching this video. Love you guys very much and I'll see you later. Bye. Mwah.